fast research excellence. A researcher with his team from the Hong Kong Polytechnic University has developed neuromorphic sensors for in sensor computing. In a recent study published on the issue of Nature, Volume 579, there are some drawbacks of conventional artificial visual system for image sensing and processing. Problem 1. Conventional artificial visual system consists of physically separated image sensing and processing units, which suffers two major drawbacks, redundant data and complex circuitry. And problem 2. It is difficult to process abundant image data rapidly enough for real-time processing and decision-making, especially important for delay-sensitive applications. Project Overview In this work, we developed a novel device named Optoelectronic Resistive Memory RM. It is capable to converge sensing, storage and processing in one. We fabricated RM arrays. The image of letter F is memorized firstly, and then the contrast of F images enhanced significantly by pre-processing of Vorum. We also constructed an artificial visual system as a proof of concept. It is consisted of two parts, Vorum arrays, and image recognition through neural network. As expected, the noise signals is reduced effectively based on the pre-processing of Orom array, where we can see much clearer letters from blue background. Based on this advancement, the accuracy in subsequent image recognition tasks can be largely improved. In short, our Orom device shows great potential being the sensor front end, which can be used to simplify the circuitry of a neuromorphic visual system and also contribute to the development of applications in edge computing and the Internet of Things. For further applications, research strategies are not limited to the visual system, it also can be developed in different kind of artificial intelligence inputs in the future. Auditory, tactile, thermal, olfactory, and more possibilities. The conclusion is, in order to meet the rapid development of IoT, it is quite necessary to develop new computing paradigms that are close to or inside sensory networks and can reduce the redundant data movement between sensing and processing units for enhancing speed, power efficiency, and integration density. Thank you.